Hello guys, before we get started on today's video, if you haven't already, please hit the subscribe button down below and get your makes entered into the C family. And also, if you get notified whenever I post a video, please hit the notification bell button. Okay, so today I just received, I've already opened one up, but I've just received five weed caps. So I've already opened up one of these weed caps. I've been wondering, so I got my weed caps here, count with two. I don't know what that, why that is. Put like one on or put two on, I don't know. But I received weed caps. So, if you don't know, I, I have ordered a wig ages ago. So I'm going to take it. I'm not going to brush her hair out actually, because she's kind of matted. So I've ordered this beautiful girl off of eBay and she was the first thing out of my out of the wigs that I've ordered. Out of all the things that I need to customize a wig, she's the first thing that comes. I'm still waiting on a pair of scissors, but for now I'll probably end up using some kitchen scissors to cut her and that and customize her. So we're gonna be customizing this girl today. We're going to be customising this girl today to make her suitable for me and my style and how I like her. She's quite long. She's not going to be this long for really long because it's really hard to brush long wig hairs. So I've noticed that when I first put her on. So I've got a wig stand that I will be sitting her on. And I do have a hairbrush sitting right here. This is my wig hairbrush. It actually wasn't meant for a wig. It was actually meant for human hair. Here's my name on it, but this is not the softest hairbrush that I've got for wigs that I could use for my wigs, but I can actually use it on my actual hair. So I decided to turn this into my wig hairbrush. And I will be using kitchen scissors, which I will go get back. And I also will be washing her hair. So if you just give me a minute, I'll duck my head down and I'll bring over my stuff. So I will be washing the wigs, so I will be using my shampoo and conditioner to wash her. And then I will be using my hair dryer to blow dry the wig. And then I will be using a heat protectant, so I don't end up damaging the wig because it's, con it's th synthetic hair. Like, synthetic hair is more fragile than human hair wigs. But even human hair, you still want to treat it all the same. Now we'll be using my hair strainer. I got this last year for my birthday. And we'll also be using my oils for this wig. We won't be using too much of this oil because this can make the wig really, really grease. So I think all we will need for this wig. And we'll also be using my wig caps for my hair and that. So yeah, I think that's all we'll need for the wig and I also need a pair of scissors which I will go get that. I do have hairdressing scissors that's coming on away. So I don't really want to wait because I've been waiting for all these products at the moment to come and they finally have. So I'm not going to wait any longer. I'm going to get into the bathroom and start customising this wig. Okay, so I did film me washing her hair and conditioning her. But for some reason, it's not going on my camera thing. So, all I did is got first to scrub her hair with my shampoo. And then all I did is just from the end down, I conditioned and I virusly washed her out. So sorry, I, if I do find it on my camera blog, I will put it in the video. But all I'm going to do now is put her on a wig stand and blow dry her. Before I blow dry her, I've got a heat protectant on her to protect her hair. So, yeah. Hello guys. So some of these clips aren't really working. I'm so sorry. 
about that. I'm sure my best to film everything, but obviously some of them are coming up. So what I've done on this wig at the moment is just cut her hair. Some braids and that clip cancelled and didn't end up going through. Just to let you guys know that that's what happened. So I want to put the wig on my head and then I want to come back and finish it off. So I'm back. As you see, I've got the wig cap on and I wanted it to be here. But because I'm falling off the bench, as you know, so I'm going to have to up to here. So I've got to like try my best to fix this. I've got another one coming in the mail, so it is okay. And to be honest, I got like a box. To be honest, so I'm actually going to do the. I don't know. Hair tie method, I think. These are definitely not. the best scissors I've used. Definitely not. So it's going to be a bob no matter what I do. And I'm sorry that that was a hot mess. I'm literally sweating in this bathroom. There's nothing I can do about that either. Have a look at the back. I wonder. So I think this is like the best I can actually do. Now I've got chuck on a hat. So I kind of want to... Now, looking at myself, kind of want to... Oh, why is that one that one? Definitely not now, my last week. Tell you that now. So, kind of want to get myself some framing here. Oh god, how am I supposed to do this side? my real hair but my hair's a tiny bit longer than this week now but honestly don't mind this length at all I can like flip on a cap or a hat maybe I don't know this week might do it for me I think so I don't really want to play around with it anymore I'm going to go blow dry my hair and then I'm actually going to come back and straighten it. Okay, so I'm back and I haven't straightened it, but instead I kind of want to put, give myself some space buns. How about half down space buns? This is definitely not best wig in my opinion now but I am getting another one off of eBay Ooh. don't think that actually looks too bad in my opinion I reckon that's kind of cool Ok, 
Okay, this one's not really doing its thing for me now. So I'm back now, sorry, the video I did cut it up. So, oh, I bought these space ones, they're quite cute. Now I'm just going to take this big, I'm going to take the space ones out. So I can show you what the wig actually looks like for the finishing product. This is my first wig that I've customised, so be aware of that. I'm so sorry, this is not the best customised wig because this is my first customised wig. And it should have been a lot better. But I didn't mean for it to cut off so much length at all. I, I, I wanted it to be about here but it's okay like a bob it's not too bad honestly for this customised wig it isn't too bad at all. I can do with it. I wish I did a lot better when I cut it but okay it, it could have been better but I do have another wig on its way and I'll see how that ends up and I'll just, if I do customise that wig, it won't be as bad as this one, I can tell you that now. So I do like this wig. I wish it was a little bit longer, but I really like it. So that gives you up for the, for the um, video. I'm so sorry that all my videos didn't really work. I've tried my best and I've put whatever I filmed and what did work. So I'm really sorry about that. So I might end this video here. If you haven't already, please hit the subscribe button. So you'll be automatically entered into the C family. And also, if you don't like get don't like miss another one of those amazing videos, then hit the notification bell button and you can notify whenever I post another video. So bye guys. I can take this wig off now. Woohoo! So that's what the wig caps look like once it's on, by the way. Okay, bye!